which is creating a closure this morning. This is out along Van Dyke, and you'll find that it's closed in both directions between Forest and Gratiot. If you usually travel this area of Van Dyke, not far from 94, you may want to try using Mount Elliott as an alternate route, and we'll be keeping you posted online, WXYZ.com, under my traffic blog to let you know once it opens. Also, we have an accident eastbound M5, Grand River at Evergreen, and then southbound 75 at 14 Mile. Here's a look at one of our traffic problems that we do need to point out on our first alert traffic map here. One is the closure of Van Dyke. It's closed both directions between Forest and Gratiot. You may want to try using Mount Elliott as an alternate route. That's near 94. Also, we have an accident that just came in along 96 on the eastbound lanes at the Davison. And then we're still waiting to see this one clear eastbound Grand River near Evergreen where the right lane is blocked. Here's a look at one of our traffic cameras right now. and We'll see if it's any better out here. This is 70